Hello devs welcome to code in short and today we are going to learn about axios in the previous video we named these three babies as john tony and chris but what if there are a whole lot of babies how do we name them all well uh, we can take help of our friend named the internet right so we are going to use axios to fetch names from json placeholder library using axios so let us install axios by going to npm and we will search axios in it this is where we get the library and we will copy this command npm install axios and paste it in our terminal after pressing enter it will install axios in our react.js application okay let us import it as soon as possible import axios from axios great but how do we use it well we will need the use effect hook from react so we'll import it as well then we are going to delete the names array which we created previously we don't need it as axios is going to take care of it for us later we will write use effect function and in that use effect we are going to use axios we will need a state variable instead so we will create a state a variable named users which will store all of our user details in it so we will set this variable as users and the function will be set users the initial value will be an empty array fine so now let us initialize the use effect function below it so use effect great so we will erase all of this as we do not need it okay now we need axios code so we will go back to npm copy this code given below and paste it inside the use effect function we will change the url and we will erase all the comments we don't need them right now so the url we will console.log the results so that we could see them first in the we will go to json placeholder it is a simple api and we will click in the users which gives us we will copy this url and paste it in the get url part let us save it and see if we get the response then we will set the response.data as users to use them inside the babies component so great set user response dot data and user if we will change this part as users and users dot map so users and the name will be users dot name fine great so let us start and check it npm start and uh, let us give it a minute running successfully we got 10 names for now and also the state variable age does change so we haven't affected it that's all for today's video to like share and subscribe this video and also if you have any suggestions or questions write them below in the comment box i try to reply all of them as soon as possible also share this videos to as many developers as possible and do not forget to press the bell icon have a great day